so. most important question is, what do you think about Good Luck Charlie? <laughs> oh, why are you <laughs> with Amy Duncan? Yeah! <laughs> Are you proud to be American? Of course. I am. Of course. Yeah, for the most part, yeah. It depends. Depends on the day. Depends on the day. All right. Sometimes. Sometimes. What makes you proud to be American? Our history, our culture, our diversity. It's a great place to be. I get to do whatever I want every day. I'm not under jurisdiction, I guess. We have a lot of freedoms more than other countries, I would say. What makes your answer sometimes be proud of America? Uh. A lot of war crimes. A lot of war crimes. Our history is pretty bad, so that's something that makes me less proud to be American. But I'm happy for the freedom that we have. I'm happy for the things that we're able to do on a daily basis. Like just, just breathing and walking here is something that a lot of people take for granted every day. You have to pick one, First Amendment or Second Amendment? I would say Second Amendment. You don't have the first without it. That's a hard one, but I would say without the first, you don't really have anything without freedom of speech. Right to bear arms all day. Definitely right to bear arms. <laughs> second amendment, second amendment, for sure. Second amendment. <laughs> the second amendment, we need to bear arms. Yeah, we do need to bear arms. There were freedom of speech, I value that more, yeah. What would you do to control the second amendment? Would you be for banning firearms, more regulation? Not, not banning them, because that just gives people who do get guns illegally, because that would happen. People who get guns illegally to harm people who who got their guns taken away or can't have guns. What issue concerns our generation, Gen Z, the most? Inflation is, is killing us. It's, I'm scared because I'm 18 and I, I don't know how I'm going to afford a house or how I'm going to pay for rent. Uh, I think people are paying most attention to maybe the economy. Ooh, probably. I feel like the impact that social media has on our generation, many people will hear one thing and they take it as a fact when it's not. The right to bear arms. The right to bear arms. Keeping our gun right. Yeah. My concern is I want to be able to play whatever a political figure is saying into a classroom, and right now I couldn't. Just it it used to, you could play a political debate, and you can't now. Very interesting. I didn't know that. Anything involving like race relations, equal rights. What is one issue that you wish Gen Z cared more about? I would definitely say inflation. Inflation? Yeah. Um, conserving the nuclear family. Mm. Yeah, the border crisis is definitely an issue we need to handle first. Freedom of speech. Freedom of speech. Yeah. Protecting the Constitution. Yeah. Just getting back to real morals and not so much of a picture painted lifestyle. You say like bring back more traditional value? Right. Uh, access to abortion. Mm. Yeah, uh, bod bodily autonomy. Getting enough money to buy a house. That's true. Inflation. We got a lot of economic problems where my generation seems to can't afford anything or save money. Democracy. Democracy. Yes, just keeping what we have because it might not be the best, but it's the best in the world. So. It's true. We got to keep freedom free. Yes. I think they need to be more aware of politics because a lot of people think they know politics, but they don't know. They just they just like to talk, and they don't they don't they don't know what they're talking about. I feel like um, it's a lack of caring for people. Mm -hmm. That's why it's no consideration yeah. for others. If you had any political power, what would be the first thing you would do? Stop spending as much money. We definitely need to rework those checkbooks. Oh, man. Close the southern border? Uh, I would say lock in on the abortion issues. Uh, world peace. World peace. Oh, yeah, equal rights to uh, everyone. Get rid of taxes. Get rid of taxes. Same thing, get rid of taxes. Get rid of taxes. I think I would set term limits. I think not having term limits is a really big issue. I'd probably invest into seeing less homeless people. Ah! Making it so they have somewhere to go or helping them out. We have too much government help for them to still be homeless, you know? I'm not... I don't know. I'm more into the cultural side of, of okay, like it. the conservative movement. The so important question is, what do you think about Good Luck Charlie? Leanne Baker, if you had any political power, what would you do? Rule the world. Ba Bam! <laughs> you know what? I America's mom right here. That's right. I'll love you up real good. <laughs> Let me have your own thought and view relating to this um, particular one and in line. Please and please drop it in the comment section. No insultive words, let's know what um, cause uh, is seen in the comment section. So I'll be expecting your comments, drop it in the comment section. So if you want us to be friends, why not hit on the subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell so you get notified by YouTube anytime videos like this drop. 
for all our returning subscribers. I appreciate you all for always coming back to check on any of the updates or videos we have on the channel. I appreciate you all. I don't take a lot for granted. You guys are the real MVP. So thank you guys. I appreciate you. Uh, I, I want to write to this particular one. All right belongs to the rightful content creator of this great piece of art. With I don't intend to infringe on the copyrighted materials. The main purpose of this video is to educate, enlighten you, and also inspire you um, in the little knowledge you haven't known. So thank you. If you intend to support this channel, why not? Check on the description, you'll see where you can support the channel. Buy me a coffee. That way, you tend to support us with a little you can. Let's build the brand better. I know with your support, with everyone's support, with our collective support, this brand will move, move further. So, thank you. Don't forget to like and help the algorithm to push this video to a larger audience and let's build the brand better. So, thank you. See you in the next one. Do what? Stay put. Stay safe and stay subscribed. Before I forget, if you have a video recommendation you want me to react to, drop it also in the comment section. I will be excited to react to the video of your choice. So come your way. See you in the next video. It's bye for now.